is basically just going to do my p over q plus or minus. It's going to be plus or minus all the factors of 6 over plus or minus all the factors of 1. Well, that's really just going to be plus or minus 6, comma, plus or minus 3, comma, plus or minus 2, comma, plus or minus 1. Right? Now, if you are going to, if you don't have a calculator, you don't know which ones work, then you just have to start at positive 1, and then go to negative 1, then do 2, then do negative 2, right? And how can you check? There's two different ways we talked about. You could either do yeah. to the division or, or you could if you wanted to, but the remainder theorem, because if the remainder theorem, if the remainder is 0 by the factor theorem, that tells you it's a 0 or it's a factor, right? So, um, however, I'm just going to, actually, you know what? I think 1 and negative 1 work, so let's try 1. It's not going to take that long. So I do 1. Um, I make sure I put my coefficients. OK, so you take 1. Take 1, bring it down. 1 times 1 is 1. 1 plus 1 is 1. 1 times 1. 1 That's why you got to be careful. 2 times 1 is 2. 5 plus 2 is 7. 7 times 1 is 7. Negative 1 plus 7 is going to be 6. 6 times 1 is negative 6, 0. It works. Yeah, yeah, I said it right, but Wait. it works. Sorry, sorry, sorry. But does everybody agree that this works? OK, now good. However, ladies and gentlemen, as I mentioned, this is a quadratic um, constant. That's a cubic polynomial, right? It's x third. Shh. It's a cubic. You're not going to be able to factor this. I mean, you might be able to look at it, and I'm not going to be able to factor this. So I know. So therefore, I need to further refine it, right? So let's go ahead and try negative 1 and see if also negative 1 is a factor. So I'll bring down the answers to 7, 6, and 0 is a remainder. So I'm not going to worry about that. Yes? Does this mean you'll have three zeros because you have a degree of three? Four zeros. OK. So let's go and try negative 1, see if negative 1 works. I bring down the 1. 1 times negative 1 is negative 1. 2 plus negative 1 is 1. 1 times negative 1 is negative 1. 7 plus negative 1? Negative 6. works, too. So right now, my factored form, if 1 is a 0, what's my factor? X minus 1. If x minus 1 is a 0? Listen, listen, does everybody agree that's my factor form? Yes. 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 Now, can, if you were to do zero prior property, we already know that's a zero one. We already know that's a zero negative one. However, this one, we have to factor it. But look it out. What two numbers multiply to give you six, add to give you one? Three. Crap, it's not factorable. It's not factorable. So guess what you have to do? Quadratic formulas. Oh, no, I'm not done, please. I'm not done. I'm not done. No. I got to tell you guys something. One last quick thing. So that's 1 squared. That's the square root of negative 23 over 2. Shh. So I could also write that as x equals negative 1 half plus or minus um, 1 half times the square root of negative 23. So what I want you guys to understand here is there's two complex solutions, right? And there's two real zeros, right? What I want you guys to understand is write down Descartes' rule of signs. Write it down, because you're going to need to probably go and look it up there. I have videos online. But I want you guys to see what we're talking about. What Descartes' rule of signs, you guys need to see this and visualize this. What Descartes' rule of signs says is the number of positive real zeros is equal to the sign changes of your polynomial. Well, how many sign changes do I have? 
Just one. So what they're saying is there's only one real positive zero. And is that true in my example? Yeah, there's only one real positive zero, right? And then the number of negative is the number of negative is the number of sign changes. I don't have to go through. I'll just remind me to review this again. But it's the number of sign changes of f of negative x equals um, the number of negative zeros. I'll go back over that. I do have homework. I do have videos on it. So please plan to get your.